Okay, peoples, we got a fresh clock. We got a fresh clock, and welcome back to another episode of Tank Nation. So now this is a preload. So I got my paperwork. I went inside and got my paperwork. I just finished a 10 hour break. So I want to make sure that all my bills, I have all my bills, which I have the bill of landing. This is the delivery receipt. I have a bill of landing. My copy. I got a customer, a copy for the customer. I got two scale tickets. Okay. I got two scales. And the most important part that I need is. Hold up. And it's called a certificate of analysis. So let me look on this one again and see. Okay, this one is a scale ticket and a. Let me see. I want to make sure. Oh, does this one need a certificate of analysis? Okay, we got that, we got the bill. So this is a scale ticket and this may be, no, it's just a scale ticket, so it doesn't have a C or A. So maybe it doesn't need one for this particular one. But I'll go back inside and check with dispatch and make sure that this is the same we have paperwork for the certificate of analysis for this particular one. But usually it'll say C of A. So what I'm going to do is, while the truck is warming up, I did a pre-trip before the pre-trip, so I already inspected my truck tires and everything, so I always do a pre-trip before the pre-trip. So now, we're going to go inspect the trailer. So we're going to go ahead and, and we're going to move pretty quick because, like I said, I drove in in, like, well not like I said, that, that makes no sense. I drove in this morning from a load that we took to South Carolina over the weekend and brought it back in and I drove, then I went home, spent a few hours there, dropped some more cool content, right? And did some other things. And then we drove in this morning, dropped the empty trailer off to the customer and then I had this one, I had this one preloaded. So the trailer is preloaded. So we're gonna make sure that paperwork in the trailer matches. So the trailer is 11483. And I'm gonna go and do a pre-trip of the trailer. We're gonna do a real quick walk inspection. I already did a pre before the pre, but I said let me go back and go back over and take y'all along with me so y'all see what, what happens in that process. So we're gonna do a pre before I bring the truck over and check. So Actually, we're gonna walk through it. Oh, camera's a little crooked. So just by on the visual side, the first thing I wanna check for is my emergency shutoff. And that's that right there. So there's a case, if there's an emergency, I can hit this here and break this off and it will automatically close the, the rear internal valve. This is not a um, placard load, so it's a non-hazmat. Make sure these haven't been bent. These here is the truck air, trailer air, and this is my, um, for my electrical, which they call where the pigtail goes in. Sometimes they'll say service and emergency air. This is for steam. Make sure that the inspections are good to go, which is good to go. I can also air off. Got steam here inlets. This is also a, what's called a rear unloader because there's nothing on the side or the belly. It's not a trans, it's not a trans, um, it's not a, what is called an in-transit heat load, so. Temperatures doesn't matter. And then my tires. Make sure the tires are good to go. And these are indicators to make sure that if they're the other way means that it's loose. So these are indicators to let you know that your, your tires are on nice and tight. These here are a little bit damaged, but the lights are good to go. Hold on for a second. Let me get, put my gloves on. Hold up for a second. Hopefully it won't fall. multi-tags here and then you want to check this is good to go this is good to go make sure this nice and tight that's tight it's sealed off with the with um wire seal good to go no leaks lights good lights in place it's a little bit damaged here so we'll we'll make the notations that it's, it's damaged already these are good to go wheel indicators are good to go 
got reflective tape on so everything is good to go no damages no visible damage and once again this is a non um hazardous load so that doesn't matter so i'm gonna go ahead and go up top oh we're going the other side we're gonna run up top real quick come hook up and we're going to drive about six hours tonight and then shut it down and then pick up again tomorrow so this delivers on friday no big hurry so let's see so i'm gonna go up top and ensure that it's good to go checking the ladders make sure it's good to go so the only thing that is going to be left after i go up top and check is we'll hook up check the lights and be good to go always making three points of contact one two three four points in this case Mama Mia, hook up, lights good to go. We're gonna get on the road. So this load here is going to North Charleston, South Carolina. So I'm going to going to actually um, vlog this whole trip for the most part. So that's it. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And to subscribe, hit the like button. And once again, y'all know the routine. Y'all been seeing these YouTube channels. They've been around a lot longer than I have. It helps our algorithms, which I do have good algorithms. I just gotta continue putting the work in. Um, you know, in order to gain y'all trust and y'all um, confidence in me that I will continue to um, drop decent content, call it content for you. So once again, hit that red subscribe button. And then on this one here, I just learned how to recently how to watermark my page. So if you go not to vertical, but to landscaping, when it turns sideways, you'll see that red dot, I think over here in the corner, that says subscribe or this corner over here. Either way, it should be a red watermark. Hit that. And it'll show Tank Nation. You can hit the subscribe and then let's grow together. Because once again, this is not my channel. This is your channel. Because once it's all about you guys, you men and you ladies and whatever. So hopefully, this is very helpful and informative. Okay? You know what time it is. Be great. Give me your face. Boop, boop.